Well, Mo, congratulations on the new deal. How does it feel to finally get it all sorted? Very excited. Um, just glad to be here, you know, and can't wait for the season to start. I mean, you joined us midway through last year. You had a real impact both on the pitch and with the fans as well. How much of an impact did that play in you rejoining us? Uh, one of the main reasons because of the fans, you know, the way I've been treated when I was here and um, the support they've given me is one of the main reasons why uh, I'm back here and just loved every bit of moment, like every minute of it. Yeah, we'd love to see you on the pitch as well. Obviously, that injury at Harley Court as well, the cool drop for a bit. I'm assuming you're back and ready to go for the next season now. Ah, oh, yeah, I've done the strengthening work, you know, to get my ankle back to where it was and uh, done the extra training sessions that I've been doing, you know, preparing myself for the new season. Um, and as I said, like, I'm just just to just to even looking at the grass now, it's like I get all the memories again of, of last season. So I'm just looking forward to be back. And a lot of fans might have seen you know keeping yourself fit for those pre-season videos you've been doing on personal coaching. How important has that been for you to keep yourself ready for next year? I think that's one one thing I do every se season to try to prepare well. You know because I would, I believe that if you can get a good start, then the momentum goes out through the whole season. So I just want to make sure that I can improve on what I did last season and um, just score the goals. And how much of the manager's influence has it been on you rejoining us? How much before was that? Uh, one of the main reasons why I signed in the start was because of Danny. You know, he knows me as a player and he gives me that kind of confident boost, you know. And um, I've just... Manager's a big reason for me, you know, because as, as you know, football is based all on opinions and obviously with Danny being there, he just gives me that little confident boost when I need it. and. Um, it brings out the best in me, and you know, I think towards the end of the season, well, not end of the season, but towards before the, uh, the corona outbreak, um, I thought the fans started seeing what kind of player that, I'm, that I am. And the season's obviously been slightly delayed due to the current climate as well. How, what have you been doing during that time to keep yourself occupied? Well, to be fair, at the start of it, it was just more Call of Duty, you know, with, uh, with, walk, <laughs> with walks. But, um, Nah, it's, it's, it, it, at the start it was quite hard, but uh, to, I, when the restrictions got a bit more easier, I started like doing a bit more training sessions. So the last month and a half, I've been keeping my trying to get to the fitness that I need to be for the new season. We mentioned the fans, but obviously you turned into something of a fans' favourite here. I'm sure you re-signing next year will be something they want to hear in these difficult times. Uh, I hope so because I love playing in front of them, and um, you know, it's one of the, as I said, one of the main reasons why I signed and. Um, I'm just looking forward to be, being back out there. Looking back and being back out there, have you got any personal goals or targets for next year? Um, as I said, uh, I'm a very ambitious person. Um, I just want to improve on what I did from last season and just maybe just get going from, uh, from the first game, you know, and, um, and just being in and, and as, a, as a team, I, f I believe like we have the capability of, you know, a year's experience together now. I believe that we can actually, you know, fight in the top half promotion kind of talks. Uh, um, yeah, I'm just uh, can't wait, can't wait to for a football war to start. That's something, isn't it? You know, you've not got half a year to get some of the boys. You've got a whole season to sort of hit the ground running and get where you want to be. Yep, um, I, and I will have a pre-season with them as well. So the only the boys, the, us, will only get um, more tight on, you know, close to each other, and you know that will show on the football pitch as well. Are you in with a shot? This week's winner is... For more information, click the link below. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.